Morrison v. Olson, 1988. In 1978, Congress passed the Ethics in Government Act, which created a special court and gave the Attorney General of the United States the power to recommend to the special court the appointment of an independent counsel to investigate and prosecute government officials of federal crimes. In the 1980s, the House Judiciary Committee asked the Attorney General to seek appointment of an independent counsel to investigate Theodore Olson in order to determine if he had violated federal law. Alexa Morrison was appointed as independent counsel and Olson sued her. Olson argued that the Office of Independent Counsel took powers away from the executive branch, violating the principle of the separation of powers. The case went all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court. In a seven-to-one decision, the Supreme Court made several rulings on the creation of the independent counsel. First, the selection of the position did not violate the appointments clause of the Constitution. Second, the powers that were given the special court did not violate Article III, the judiciary, of the Constitution. Finally, the act did not violate the principle of the separation of powers because it did not interfere with the functions of the executive branch.